What's up, guys? I'm back here with uh, whatever my channel name is. I can't remember. It's something like Growing Experiments or something or other. My stuff's growing. Um, last time I was on here, we did a, uh, a propagation system or some something, something like that. Uh, I figured we'd check on that today, and it's been a little while. I don't. I forgot to look at that at the timestamp on that video. Let's see when the when the um when I did it. So I don't think it's a full month since I've done the little propagation thing. Son of a bitch. Pardon my French. Uh, I was just checking my thermometer. Oh, <clears throat> for my plants, I have a sensor. Uh, this one's the sensor and this one's in here that's what it is right now it says uh, 97 I can't tell if that's backwards on the if that would be backwards on the camera or yeah I'm pretty sure that's backwards hmm. but that says 97 and it'll tell you the high and the lows lowest it was today was 71 and 72 in here right now it's 97 and 84 in here the highest it was today was 113 that is crazy that sucks um that's the type of heat that <coughs> makes it hard I, I honestly I, I don't like the i don't like growing stuff in that type of heat 90 degrees yeah you, you're getting up there 80 that's pretty that's a good spot 80 and 90 is pretty good but Dang, I'm 113 degrees. That's that's hot. I'm glad I got central AC. <laughs> but uh, anywho, let's get started. Uh, my roses. I got a rosebud now too. Let's get started. Um, how do I want to cut this plant up? Let's see. I got some. I think I got some loppers over here. Yep, I found some loppers in my garage. They should work. Hopefully. Wish me luck. Got a lot better camera, too. I got a new phone. Yeah. Well, you guys can see the, um, my rose. Yeah, well, these are actually my mama's roses. And I'm just putting claims on them. For the simple fact that she killed them and I had to revive them. Matter of fact, I could, that one was too dead to revive. But this one, this one turned out pretty good. Hopefully it'll get bigger by next year. Not really putting off too many smells. Ew, look at that. Look at that. You see all the little wormies? You see them moving around in there? That's mosquitoes. If y'all didn't know what that, if y'all didn't know that, that's what mosquitoes are. Little wormies in there, in the water. Yeah, I don't know if, uh, I don't think I did a video on it, but I did end up having to like tie it up to the, um, I had to tie it up because it slid down. Next day it was like down down here. Matter of fact, you can see where it slid a little bit in the bark. But uh yeah, let's see uh let's lop it off and see what we'll lop it off about. Right there. Let's see what that done. Kind of excited to see if it worked. I don't really care about the bush. I'm probably going to just throw the bush away. I just want to see if it started rooting and did like it was supposed to, like they said it was going to do. I don't know. I'm one of those people that I'll see something on a, on a video and I'll be like, I could definitely do that. 
I don't believe you. I feel like you photoshopped even though you didn't. So let's do it. Let's do it. I'm going to do it myself. So let's see. Um, I can't get to my chair because there's so much crap in the way. So I guess we'll just sit here. Pardon my messy garage. There's just a lot of crap out here. I also found an eastern worm snake since the last time I was on here. Uh, I'm just gonna go out there and take this cup off and these strings off. Okay, I'm back. Are you guys ready to see the results? It did absolutely shit. Pardon my French. No, I don't think you're supposed to cuss on YouTube, but... That is not the results that you guys showed me. Like, everything I researched, there was like roots going everywhere and it was wild and they had them there for like a month. Yeah, I don't think I had mine up there for a full month, but that little bit of just nodding is all I got. There's no roots here. Where'd the roots go? I didn't knock them off in the dirt. Now, I mean, I did rinse it off so that y'all could see a little bit cleaner that there's not even a place where roots have started yet. I'm starting to think the propagation is a load of crap. Maybe you have to leave it on there longer. You know what actually happened? You know what it makes it even worse? There was a freaking ant hill inside that cup. There was ants all over my hands. That's part of the reason I had to rinse my hands off. Like that, that didn't work. That was just so terrible. It, it's trash. Uh, maybe you can't do it on this bush. Maybe it takes longer on this bush. I don't know. Hell, I don't even know what kind of bush this is. I just don't like it. It grows into my fence. Tears up my fence. I don't like it. But maybe it worked for y'all. I don't know. Y'all tell me what you think in the comments. Maybe it's only certain plants that you can do it with that grow that fast or something. I don't know. I thought this bush kind of grew a little bit fast, in my opinion, because I have to trim it so often. But, yeah, that did nothing. So, I guess that's part of experimenting you. You have positive results and negative results. Let's move on to something cooler. You guys want to see my uh, eastern worm snake? 
moisten his thing down a little bit. Gotta find him. The dirt's a little bit chilled too. I might turn the lamp on. Sometimes if you tap that lamp, it's kind of going bad. It was just a random lamp I found in the house so that uh, I could keep him warm. I found him out in the backyard. Oh, there he is. There he goes. You're still doing good. Look at you. You're getting fat, too. I didn't quit feeding you so many worms. Let me see if y'all can get a glimpse of him. They don't bite. He's got a pointy tail. And he latched on real quick this time. But uh, they've got pointy tails and itty bitty mouths. But yeah, that's an eastern worm snake. Or western worm snake. I'm not really sure what the difference is between eastern and western worm snakes. Like, they really look a lot alike but Ben says we're on the east coast I'm gonna call him an eastern worm snake he's like I don't feel like being in film today where are you going buddy I don't even know where your head is anymore Oh, nope, his head's over here. That was his butt. Come on, guy. I'm just trying to show you off a little bit. There he goes. There's his head. And he, he, they're really awesome when they go to burrow. Like, when they go to... When you put him back in his home. Give me a second. I gotta, I gotta fix up his enclosure. Don't worry, he's in my... In the hand that's holding the camera. He's just crawled up on my hand. So he's okay. Don't, I ain't hurting my snake any. If y'all are worried. Or some people are. I don't, even, I don't know if it's... I don't think it's illegal to have them. I don't think they're endangered or anything. I've seen a lot of kids on YouTube with them. But... He's in my backyard, so... I figured I'd keep him and make him a nice little home got him some food i got him a bunch of worms but anyway check him out watch him watch him go the only way to tell that he's gone that he's going is to watch his tail and he's gone again. They're not very aggressive either. They're wonderful. They're kind of wonderful pets from what I've seen for, like, if you want, if your kid's are like, I want a snake, I want a snake, this is the snake you should try and find for them for the simple fact that they don't bite and you can hold them. Like, they're not, well, you can hold them there. They're not too bad. I, I like them. Let's put him a couple worms in there. And then we'll end the video. Find most. Woo! Pretty sure most of these worms are about dead. They're still crawling around in there. I'll throw him two in there. That's all you feed him. I got them from the damn bait shop. I might dump that out later and go get him some more. Just throw them down there. Fuck them. Get so dry on that thing. I 
I mean, the worms don't even burrow as fast as he does. Watch this. Worms are like, yeah, I don't feel like going. I'll leave when I feel like it. But him, on the other hand, he was instant down into that dirt. And all you use, see, all I use is the potting soil that I've been using for my plants. Like, you don't want fertilizer or nothing in there, but... Which I don't think it would re even hurt him then because he doesn't eat fertilizer. He eats worms. Let's see. What did I get? Where did I, where did I put that? Oh, there it is. This thing says... Um, that's what I put him in. Right there. I mean, it should, it should be fun. Well, I reckon I'm done with this video. I'm about to go in and relax. Uh, if anybody watch watches, I appreciate it. Appreciate the views and the likes and the subscribers and yada, yada, yada. But later, guys.